वेलकम टू मैथ्स एंड साइंस बाय आई चैनल इन दिस लेक्चर विल बी टॉकिंग अबाउट ए वेरी गुड एग्जांपल ऑफ फाइंडिंग ए सॉल्यूशन व्हेन ओनली सिंगल इक्वेशन इज गिवन अंडर सर्टेन कंडीशंस हियर द कंडीशन इज द वैल्यूज ऑफ ए एंड बी वेरिएबल्स ए एंड बी आर नॉट इक्वल टू जीरो व्हाट वी हैव टू फाइंड इज a square plus b square is equal to how much what is given is only single equation without any numerals a plus b is equal to square root of ab this is what is the information we have got we have to solve for a square plus b square is equal to how much when a and b are not equal to zero that means non trivial solution is required when a and b are equal to zero then right hand side and left hand side are zero we don't want that situation we want some solution and let's proceed further it's a very good example please pay attention to each and every step try to understand it it's a good example what is the question given a plus b is equal to square root of ab and a and b are not equal to 0 find a square plus b square solution a plus b is equal to square root of ab by squaring on both sides what happens squaring on both sides it implies a plus b whole square is equal to square root of ab whole square that implies a plus b whole square is equal to ab that implies a square plus 2ab plus b square is equal to ab that implies when you bring ab on the left hand side a square plus 2ab my plus b square minus ab is equal to 0 that implies a square plus ab plus b square is equal to 0 this is the equation simplified equation For a plus b is equal to square root of a b, where a and b are not equal to zero, then at under what values of a and b this particular equation a square plus a b plus b square will be zero? That's what is our quest. Now a square plus a b plus b square is equal to zero. It's a quadratic equation. It will have two roots that is a and b will have and let's assume let us assume a by b is equal to x that means a is equal to bx let us assume this way then what happens you replace a with bx bx whole square plus bx into b plus b square is equal to 0 because a is not equal to 0 and b is not equal to 0 we are able to assume since a b not equal to 0 that's what is given hence we can safely assume a by b is equal to some x some value x which is not equal to 0 then this equation becomes b into x whole square plus b x into b plus b square is equal to 0 then we will take b square as common x square plus a x plus 1 is equal to 0 that implies x square plus x plus 1 is equal to 
it is in the form of a quadratic equation quadratic equation and the roots of which are x is equal to minus b plus or minus b square minus 4ac by 2a x is equal to minus b plus or minus square root of b square minus 4ac by 2a if a x square plus b x plus c is equal to zero. That means what is the value of a here? X square plus x plus one is equal to zero implies when you compare it with a x square plus compare. Here we'll write comparing with. A x square plus b x plus c is equal to zero. That implies what it implies. A is equal to one. B is equal to one. C is equal to one. That means x is equal to Minus b plus r minus square root of b square minus four ac by two a. That is equal to minus one plus r minus square root of one square minus three divided by two. Do you agree? Please recollect your knowledge about the solution of. Finding the solution of a quadratic equation, where I have explained in my previous lectures. Now, x is equal to minus one plus or minus square root of. Here it is minus four, not minus three. It is minus four. One minus four. Four into one. One minus four is square root of minus three whole divided by two. That is equal to minus one plus r minus three i square root of minus three. Do you agree? That means x is equal to minus one plus r minus square root of three i whole divided by two. That is equal to x is equal to minus half plus r minus root three by two i. What is x? X is equal to what we have taken a by b is equal to x. A by B is equal to x. Therefore, A is equal to B into x. That is equal to B into minus one by two plus root three by two i, which implies A square is equal to. B square into minus one by two plus root three by two i whole square. That implies a square 
प्लस बी स्क्वायर इज इक्वल टू बी स्क्वायर इंटू माइनस हाफ प्लस रूट थ्री बाई टू आई होल स्क्वायर प्लस बी स्क्वायर दट एम्प्लाइज ए स्क्वायर प्लस बी स्क्वायर इज इक्वल टू बी स्क्वायर इंटू स्क्वायर ऑफ दिस वन वॉट इज द वैल्यू ऑफ स्क्वायर ऑफ दिस वन बी स्क्वायर इंटू वन प्लस माइनस वन बाई टू प्लस रूट थ्री बाई टू आई होल स्क्वायर बी स्क्वायर वी हैव टेकन काम ऑफ देर फॉर ए स्क्वायर प्लस बी स्क्वायर इज इक्वल टू बी स्क्वायर इंटू वन प्लस वन बाई फोर माइनस थ्री बाई फोर प्लस टू इंटू हाफ इंटू रूट थ्री बाई टू इंटू आई दट एम्प्लाइज ए स्क्वायर प्लस बी स्क्वायर इज इक्वल टू बी स्क्वायर इंटू थ्री बाई टू वन प्लस वन बाई फोर माइनस थ्री बाई फोर इज वन माइनस वन बाई टू वन माइनस वन बाई टू इज वन बाई टू सॉरी वन प्लस वन माइनस वन बाई टू दैट इज वन बाई टू नॉट थ्री बाई टू इट इज वन बाई टू वन बाई टू दिस टू टू गेट्स कैंसिल्ड सो दट रूट थ्री बाई टू आई प्लस this is minus because it is minus half this is this sign is minus minus root 3 by 2 into i that implies a square plus b square is equal to b square into वन माइनस रूट थ्री आई बाई टू दिस इज द आंसर दट मीन्स ए स्क्वायर प्लस बी स्क्वायर ए स्क्वायर प्लस बी स्क्वायर इज डिपेंडेंट ऑन बी बिकॉज देर इज नो वैल्यू गिवेन फॉर ए एंड बी नॉट इवन ए सिंगल वैल्यू वही फाउंड द वैल्यूज ऑफ ए स्क्वायर प्लस बी स्क्वायर इन टर्म्स ऑफ सम वैल्यू ऑफ बी this value of b is a variable this variable it goes from any value it goes to any value except b is not equal to 0 b is not equal to 0 is the condition except for 0 we can take any value for b and we can have a square plus b square answer that means it has infinite solutions it has infinite solutions and if b is equal to 1 a square plus b square is equal to 1 square into 1 minus रूट थ्री आई बाई टू
that implies a square plus b square is equal to 1 minus root 3 i by 2 provided if b is equal to 1. Then if b is equal to it will be different, b is equal to 3 it will be different, b is equal to 4 it will be different and b can take complex numbers also. We never said that b is not a complex number in the problem. b can have complex number also. So that we got the solution as if b is equal to 1 this is the solution. Please remember the procedure how a particular problem can be solved if it is given in this form. If b is equal to 1, the question becomes a plus b is equal to square root of a into 1 that is equal to square root of a. Then what happens? Behavior of this equation, you please do it as a homework. If a plus b is equal to square root of 1 into b that is equal to square root of b, what happens? This is also you take it as a homework, do it. These are different thought provoking thinking processes which we have to apply practically in these type of equations where nothing is given except a b is greater uh, a b is not equal to 0 except that no other condition is given. In those situations how to solve a given equation I have shown the procedure. It is a concept and procedure. You apply whatever values you want to apply. You take a as unity and find a square plus b square. b as unity find a square plus b square. a as i you find a square plus b square b as i and you find a square plus b square. It all depends upon you. And b is equal to 1, then a square plus b square will be of a specific value. Please understand the procedure, absolve the concept and do better in the examination by applying your logic and concepts well. Best of luck to everybody. I want to stop this lecture now. Best of luck to everybody. Thank you for viewing my lecture. Thank you for seeing my video. And if you feel there is a value addition to you because of this video, kindly share and Subscribe to my channel Maths and Science by IITN.